welcome back to my channel. So today we're going to be going over my capsule wardrobe. So this is going to be for spring, well really summer because spring is over. So it's going to be for the summer. Um, obviously this is not like an ideal capsule wardrobe. This is just my capsule wardrobe. I just want to show you guys basic pieces that you can style with each piece or you can use another piece in your closet. So, before I get into the video, please subscribe to my channel, be a part of my mermaid squad, and if you are new here, I'm Arielle. Welcome to my channel. Thank you so much for clicking on this video, and don't forget to give this video a thumbs up so I know to keep creating them. So, let's get started, and I also tried all of these clothes on to show you what they look like, and I'm going to link down whatever I can find down below, because some of these pieces, like you can see, they have tags on it. So yeah, so if you guys do remember, I did declutter my entire closet. I actually split it into two parts. I tried on all of my clothes and I tried on all of my shoes. If you haven't watched that video, definitely check it out because it's just insane. Like I had way too much stuff. Okay, so the first thing I recommend for your capsule wardrobe is definitely a white and a black crop top or a tank top. I personally like crop tops and I also have tank tops as well, but you're gonna see me wearing these most of the summer because you can wear them literally with anything. You can dress them up, dress them down, and I pair them with uh, some boyfriend jeans. I don't think I have them on here, but I pair them with some boyfriend jeans, which I actually have on right now in black. I'm gonna go more into jeans once we get to that topic, but I really like, like I said, you can dress this up and dress this down. Um, you can wear heels with this, you can wear sneakers or sandals. And if you get cold, you can always just throw um, a jacket over this. I got this from Zara and it's only uh, $8, which is really nice. And I like that they're starting to do eco-friendly um, material. The tag says carefree fiber, at least 90% of ecological grown cotton. And I freaking love that because I'm trying to be a little more eco-friendly along with my minimalistic self. So let's talk about this bodysuit right here. So I definitely recommend a bodysuit because you can just throw this on if you honestly don't have anything to wear. You can wear this out if you're going out to a bar or if you're going um, to the beach or something. I don't know. Um, <laughs> you could just honestly wear this to anything. And like I said, you can pair this kind of like the same with like jeans or if you want to pair it with like a skirt, you can totally do that. I just love it because it doesn't gather like, see, this isn't a bodysuit. This is just a shirt. So it gathers. So you won't have to worry about it untucking or anything. And I definitely recommend, this is an older version. I've had this for a while now. Um, they have ones with little buttons so you can use the bathroom a little bit easier so you don't have to take your entire clothes off. Um, and then they have uh, one that has like a thong back instead of like an underwear back because you, you see like the uh, underwear lines. So definitely keep that in mind, but I definitely recommend a bodysuit. And this has a really nice low back so it adds that cute little sex appeal. So let's move on to t-shirts. So I actually got these two from Pact and they are eco-friendly company and I really like them. I got them oversized, which is okay. They fit a little bit too big. I wish I would have gotten a medium instead, but I love this. This is 100% organic cotton. It's really soft and it's just a basic white tee. And I love these with um, denim shorts. It's so freaking cute. Like, I don't know, it just has that like cool style to it. So I definitely met, recommend a white shirt, which I didn't have. I had a bunch of black shirts, but I didn't have any white ones. So I got two of these actually, just in case like I get it dirty because you know, I'm not about that keep white clean life. <laughs> but yeah, I love this. I just wanna get items that are gonna last me for a really long time. So I don't have to keep replenishing clothes in my closet. And I also got the same one in black. So yeah, and this black is not like, um, it's like a, cause you know there's different color blacks. So this is more of like a greenish based black, if that makes any sense. So definitely recommend these two guys for your closet because you can wear them with anything. Come on, you know. <laughs> so now let's move on to, this is gonna be the dress I'm gonna wear for the summer because it's so light. It's a little see-through, but I do have like a long um, tank top dress that I can wear under this. But I love this because it's breezy, it's so nice, and I definitely recommend just like a flowy, breezy dress that you can wear all summer. So you can honestly wear this to like a casual wedding or 
if you're going out to dinner and I paired it with this belt because it is a little bit on the bigger side, but I just love, look at the back detail. It's so beautiful. So definitely recommend a nice breezy dress and it could be short, it could be long, it's whatever your preference is. This one's actually both, it's a high-low, so you get best of both worlds. And honestly, you can wear this into the fall if you just pair like a blazer, um, which I paired with it, if you wear a blazer with it, and then just have some more fall attire to it. So yeah. So now moving on to bottoms. So these are my favorite shorts in the entire world. I actually got them from Target and they're Levi's, but these are perfect because they're not too short and they're not too, too long. Um, so I mostly wear these when I go to the beach or if I'm going out to a bar or something, but I freaking love these. They're so nice and they hit really nice um, on your thighs because I'm just not about that short short life. So I love these because they're not too short. I also have um, Bermuda shorts, which I'm like obsessed with. So if you want like a longer short and you're not really about like the mid-length short short type of thing, definitely try Bermuda shorts and I also got mine from Target, I believe. So definitely get yourself a good pair of shorts for the summer that you can wear all summer and then transition into next summer so you don't have to buy any more. So moving on to these white jeans. I know everyone's probably like freaking out, but definitely I recommend a nice pair of white denim because it just looks so nice. Like you just look so nice and clean. Um, and these are more of a skinny type jean. They're kind of like a jegging actually, so they fit really tight on the body. So I usually wear this with um, like one of these t-shirts. Yeah, but definitely recommend a nice white pair of jeans because it just looks like so nice. And you know, if you're afraid of just getting things on it, definitely invest in a tie to go pen because I actually got makeup on this shirt as you can like see the little stain. Um, but the tie to go pen took it right out. So just carry that, don't be afraid. And I don't believe in that rule that you can't wear white after Labor Day. I think that's ridiculous. And you can wear these with heels, sandals, sneakers, you know the drill. And then I'm gonna go over different types of fits because um, I do show in the video, I show different fits, but here I just have two um, fitted jeans. So let's go to this one. I've had these jeans for so long. Oh my God, it's been like, oh my God, like six years. So these jeans have really held up. I love them. They're by Guess and it has this cute little zipper on the side. So like I said, invest in things that you can keep for a really long time. That's the whole point of a capsule wardrobe. Um, I really like these though because it, they're high waisted and they're not too, too tight. And like I said, these are skinny jeans and they're cropped because I'm tall. So it's hard for me to find tall jeans that fit my legs. But in the summer, like it doesn't matter. The cropped is in to me still. So they're technically cropped for me, but for if you want like for yourself, I don't think it's gonna be cropped. So the different type of jeans that there are, I'm probably gonna miss some, but I'm just gonna name some that I know. Um, I know that there's like relax, there's straight, there's skinny, there's bootleg, there's bootleg, there's boyfriend, and the list goes on. You can definitely check them out. My favorite are boyfriend, um, skinny, and that's really it. Um, those are only two I really wear because boyfriend is more of like chill, relax vibe. And then for the skinny jeans, you can dress them up, which I like, or dress them down. So yeah, those are some jeans. And I do have multiple pair of jeans. And I also definitely recommend a black pair of jeans like I have on. These are just ripped. You can get like whatever style you want. But I definitely recommend black jeans because they honestly go with anything too. So yeah. Let's move on to jackets now. So this is my favorite jacket in the world. I'm gonna say that about like every piece I have. <laughs> um, I love this because it's oversized and it's ripped and it's totally my style. These two are the same type of blacks. Like this is more of like a green black. I just love this because it's so big. You can throw it over anything and it just makes you look so relaxed and cool and I love it. And this is from Boohoo and they have a tall section, so all my tall sisters out there, definitely try them out because this fits perfectly. I usually bring a jacket with me everywhere because I'm literally always cold, so just in case, I always bring it. So I either bring this one or the denim jacket I have that's cropped, you guys probably seen it on my Instagram because I wear it way too much. Um, but yeah, I definitely recommend a black denim jacket or you can just do a regular denim jacket. And the last clothing piece I wanna talk about is a blazer. So this blazer is suede. Um, I don't have a regular blazer because I think I got rid of it too because it was way past this time. But yeah, this one is suede, but you can definitely get just like a regular one. 
and I just love a basic blazer because it's really good to have. You can put it over things, like I said, you can put it over this dress, which I do um, if you're cold or something, or if you have like a business meeting, you can just use your blazer. So I just love blazers because you can just throw them over anything and they have so many different kinds. There's stripes, there's patterns, there's solid colors, there's different textures. But yeah, I think you should definitely invest in a black blazer because it's just classic, you know? It's a classic piece to have in your closet as well as like the denim jacket. These are all classic pieces. So I only like, as you guys saw, I have like way more shoes than this, but I just wanna give you guys like something to start off with if you're just, you know, starting your capsule wardrobe and you need help with shoes. So I'm going to start with my sandals. I freaking love these sandals and they literally can go with anything like you can honestly even wear these with this dress and it will just be like like I said a casual beach wedding so definitely invest in some comfortable black or nude sandals that you can wear throughout the whole entire summer because it's just you just should <laughs> the next pair I'm gonna talk about is just a basic black heel so these are my basic black heels I actually wore these like a couple of times and I was gonna get rid of these, but I just, I don't know. There's something about them. I love them. I tried them on. I was like, you know what? I'm gonna keep these. They're from Zara. They're so freaking cute. Um, I'm not a huge fan of the stiletto back anymore. I really like the thicker heel, which I'm gonna show you guys. But these are just perfect for like any occasion. Like you can wear them if you're going out, if you're going to a wedding, if you're going anywhere. It's just really good to have a basic black heel and you don't have to have really high heels if you don't want to. You can do a cute little kitten heel or you can do a wedge. Just a basic heel that you can wear with anything in your closet. So it doesn't have to be a stiletto like I said, so don't be afraid. <laughs> okay, so this is the heel that I love now. So this is a thicker back so you don't have to worry about keeping your balance. I love these. These are a basic nude heel and this is actually my nude. There's different types of nude. Um, I actually have a lighter one as well, but I recommend that everybody find their perfect nude shoe because it just adds so much, I don't know, classic style to the outfit and it's like, it's more like you, you know what I mean? Like, because not everybody is the same color. So you have to find your perfect nude shoe and you'll just, you'll be so happy because you can literally wear it with anything, anything at all. You can obviously do like a lighter one if you want to, but I just think it's a good staple to have your perfect nude in your closet. All right, one of my favorites, white sneaker. I love these actually. These are actually from Fashion Nova. Um, these are really comfortable and I like how thick the um, platform is. So you can do any like white tennis shoe you want. I just think you should have any white sneaker in your closet. So I just really love white sneakers because it just adds so much like, like I said style, I'm gonna keep using that word. It just adds so much style and like, I don't know, I feel like you, you're so cool with like your white sneakers, you know what I mean? And last but not least, you guys need some black shoes. Um, I want all black, which I don't have yet, but I have my Vans. These are great for walking. Um, if you wanna go to an amusement park, if you wanna walk around the park, if you wanna just go for a walk around the corner, um, these are good for that. And it's good for style, like I said as well, but I think everybody needs a good black basic shoe because you can, say it with me, wear it with anything in your closet. <laughs> so yeah, there's nothing really much to say about the shoes because it just goes with everything. Like, as you could see, the aesthetic here. <laughs> but yeah, those are the basics for your capsule wardrobe. If you have any questions, definitely leave them in the comments down below. Um, and what does your capsule wardrobe look like? Let me know, I would love to know. Do you have color? Are you like me, a neutral queen over here? I hope you guys like this video. I know it's something different. I really wanted to just, since I showed you guys my decluttering process, I wanna show you what I'm putting back into my closet. So that can help you as well if you wanna clean out your closet and see pieces that you need that you can wear with other things. I think this is perfect for you. Don't forget to like, share, and subscribe to my channel. Be a part of my mermaid squad. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye guys.